President Dole, President of the Club Clan Flanagan, dear colleagues, dear delegates, ladies and gentlemen, allow me to congratulate, allow me to thank Mr. Dole for the help he has given to my country during the process of integration in the European Union. President Dole, thank you very much. It is my pleasure to talk to you as a president of a sister party from Croatia. We became a full member of the European Union last year. Our party, Croatian Democratic Union, was founded 25 years ago, and since then, the party has been defining the need to return to the common European home, to European Union. Croatian government, led by Croatian Democratic Union, created and opened negotiations about the membership in the EU. We closed them and we signed the accession agreement, and this is what we are very proud of. Croatia is still getting used to its rights and obligations, as well as the benefits and challenges that result from being a member in the EU. The greatest value of being a member is the fact that Croatia and our citizens since last year have been um, members in the new area of freedom, security and law. The citizens of our country have been through a lot. They have experienced war, destructions, forceful migrations. Today do not have to fear about their freedom and security. So we in Croatia are, feel very strongly and are very compassionate about the citizens of Ukraine who are exposed to great insecurity due to latest results and latest, latest events, especially on the Crim. I'm sure that many citizens of Ukraine long for becoming a member uh, in the area of freedom, security, and law, and we must support them in that. Another thing that we are particularly worried about in Croatia is the condition in our neighboring country, in our neighbor Bosnia and Herzegovina. We worried about the lack of functionality of the state administration, economic fragility, and the position of the Croatian people, which is one of the three constitutive people. The situation in Bosnia and Herzegovina is serious, which was demonstrated recently through protests when a large number of uh, buildings was uh, destroyed. Dear friends, I urge you to understand that the condition in Bosnia and Herzegovina is very serious. We should start processes which will enable this country, Bosnia and Herzegovina, to become more effective, to be economically sustainable and the home to all three of its nations. Bosnia and Herzegovina, without uh, equal and satisfied Croatian people, cannot function as a state which longs to become integrated in the EU. On the other hand, the EU, which um, cannot be a functional engine and mediator to its neighboring country, cannot be credible on the international scene. Key parties in Bosnia and Herzegovina are part of the European People's Party. Let's get involved. Let's stimulate them. Let us help them, because the future of Bosnia and Herzegovina is in the European Union. Dear friends, ladies and gentlemen, the results of the upcoming uh, European Parliament elections will define largely the direction of the European politics in many areas which are crucially important for our more than 500 million citizens. We want to work on better European Union for, to the benefit of our citizens, all based on our action program. Our parties must mobilize all its potentials so we can again become the greatest force in the European Parliament, and so that we can have the President of the European Commission from among us. We owe this to our citizens, 
to the idea of common Europe, but we owe this also to our long-term president, late Mr. Wilfred Martins, who will tomorrow receive an award, post-mortem award, for his contribution to the EPP family. Thank you for your attention.